Yeah, right. Dream on. Morning YouTube. It's the 29th of April today, Wednesday, and we're halfway through lockdown week six. Um, be the 1st of May in a couple of days time, so April has been a write-off for riding, obviously. Uh, but we'll just have to keep on with this lockdown thing for as long as they tell us to. We've got to keep our spirits up and keep finding ourselves things to do. And for those of you who have been wondering what this tower of boxes is here, it is in fact a salvaged selection of drawers from the kitchen. Uh, when we had that ripped out, I thought I'd keep some of the drawers and maybe use them for storage in here. My plan is to get rid of all these here paint uh, paint tins that are in there and they have one or two possibly two of them suspended below there so that I've got ample storage space for putting things like spanners away and odds and ends that are li nailed to the walls as you can see around here so that's going to be my plan um, over the next few days I'm going to see if I can put that together other things I've noticed on the news, that people are still being a bit daft and getting out there and going to places when they shouldn't really be going and abusing the police and just generally being idiots. We know why this lockdown's on. We know what the reason behind it is and we know that if we don't follow the rules, the chances are that it'll just go on and on and on until it's finally um, sorted. That could take a lot longer if people don't follow what they're told to do. So let's keep up with the staying at home business as they've asked us to do as much as possible. I mean, if you have to go out because of work or whatever, fair enough. But taking a drive to the coast just for the sake of taking a drive to the coast isn't really uh, what we should be doing. Anyway, a um, bit of an update on the uh, NHS volunteering thing. Uh, I've had that switched on now for quite some time. And I've had absolutely no call outs at all. None whatsoever. And I'm hearing that other people aren't either. What seems to be happening is that there's more volunteers than there's people actually requiring assistance, apparently. So anybody out there, if, uh, if you do need help for something, contact the NHS uh, Volunteering Service and they'll let us know so that we can get out there and help you out. Be it for collecting prescriptions or doing a bit of shopping or whatever. Give them a shout so that they know that you're needed. Another thing they keep telling is that we should be wearing face masks or possibly should be wearing face masks. But where we're all supposed to be getting them from, I don't know, because if the health service can't get them, then where are we supposed to get them from? But we could improvise. At least those of us who ride will have the neck scarf thing that we could pull up over your nose and mouth. Um, failing that, you can always make something out of a piece of cloth, I suppose. But um, the general gist of things is that we have to try and do our best to stay safe. So remember, no riding out, no driving out. Stay healthy, stay safe, and stay at home. Till next time, cheers. Cheers.